The Georgia Government Transparency and Campaign Finance Commission voted to raise contribution limits. Statewide office limits raised from $6,600 to $7,000 for primary and general elections. Limits for all other offices were also raised from $2,600 to $2,800 for primary and general elections. The first session of the Indiana General Assembly adjourned on April 24th. Legislators approved more than three dozen bills, including a two-year state budget and a gaming bill that legalizes sports wagering. Iowa Senate Bill 639 would enact new statutes concerning political subdivisions, contracting with a person to lobby. The legislation requires authorities for a political subdivision to use requests for proposals to solicit lobbying services and limits the duration for lobbying contracts to five years while prohibiting renewals of contracts without new requests for proposals. And lastly, the Washington legislature adjourned April 28th. House Bill 1195 passed, amending the definitions of commercial advertiser and independent expenditure and requires reporting with the Public Disclosure Commission for expenditures exceeding $1,000. House Bill 1379 raises the threshold for identifying and disclosing the top five contributors of a political advertisement from $700 to $1,000. That's it for this week. Be sure to visit lobbycomply.com for all your government relations news. Check out stateandfed.com for answers to any compliance questions you might have. And don't forget to follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn. 